hello everyone welcome back to my channel i hope you're all doing well today i know i am if this is your first time here hi my name is Ileana, and i am on my debt-free journey trying to pay off over 100k in credit card car loan and student loans and if you're a returning subscriber hi welcome back i'm so glad you could join me so today i'm going to be doing my weekly check-in for the week of the 11th to the 19th so I'm excited I'm trying to get back I'm trying to keep on track um, before we get there I never unstuffed my cash envelopes from week one which I think you guys can see all the receipts the only thing I have is gas money so, yes, I had three dollars left which is not a lot but better than nothing let me just double check the rest of them. All these receipts. Okay, so with the $3, hmm, what do I want to do with it? I'm so rich. Um, I guess I will put it in my penny challenge as extra money. Just because I don't have anything I would want to do with it as of right now. So that is going in here just as extra money. So there we go. I just wanted to do that on camera just so I know. All right. And I'm going to have to get rid of some of these receipts. But yay. I unstuffed it and I put it away. All right. So. We are starting with the 11th. Which... Let me get my highlighters out. So we have them. I believe these are the highlighters. So orange is food, pink is personal, yellow is gas. Hold on. Pink is personal, orange is food. Yellow is gas, and blue is groceries. I'm trying to remember it. All right, so. Hope you guys can see that. So I will start with the 11th, which I did have a transaction. And that was at Publix. I try not to go to Publix that often, but I'm, that is a groceries item. I believe I grabbed some groceries for taco night. It was $14.89. Then we had the 14th, the 13th, sorry, not the 14th. The 13th, which was Starbucks. And that was food. And that was for 506. Then there was the 15th. And I went to Barnes and Nobles. That was actually my mom's birthday. And ironically, she was picking up my Easter presents. Actually, that wasn't my mom's birthday. My mom's birthday is the 16th, but she was buying my Easter presents at Barnes & Noble's because I love that store. And she asked me to buy her some Starbucks, so I did. It was 6 13 Then we have groceries. Oh, it was at this store. I put it under as groceries, but I can't remember what it's called. Sorry, what it's called. Because I trans my stepfather paid some money and unintentionally paid the whole thing. But um, I transferred 5663 to him. That was my portion. So I'll leave this blank because I really don't remember the store name. It's kind of like an outlet when you have an overage at grocery stores and they give it to that store. 
Okay, we got the 15th again. And we went to Texas Roadhouse for an early birthday present to my mom. Because we always go out for dinner on, on someone's birthday. Um, my stepfather paid for my mom and I paid for myself. Okay. And it was pretty pricey, but it was good steak, so... Thirty-four, thirty-six. Okay, and then we went to Ulta because my mom needed to pick up um, beauty supplies, and I somehow ended up getting some, um, some a new lotion and for my face moisturizer. So that's gonna be under personal. And it was a little bit price, well, not a little bit, but what you expect for Ulta, sixty nine seventy six. And then early in the day, I went to McDonald's because I was starving. A lot of transactions that day, and it was eleven forty seven. Then we had my mom's birthday, the 16th. I went to Walgreens because I had to pick up some little things for Easter, which was the next day. Woo. And I'm going to put that under personal. It was $9.98. Okay. Then... We have, I went to the movies and I just couldn't stop myself. I had to watch the new Fantastic Beats, Beasts, The Secrets of Dumbledore. So I went to the local marquee that was cheaper than AMC and such. So it was personal. And it was 11.25. And then I went to the concession stand. Okay. And it was 14. 14 for popcorn and a slushy and that's it for that week i was trying to be good trying to be in the operative word but still the same yeah i've been trying to cut back on my spending a lot so not that it's done a lot but better than the whole sheet being filled all right so groceries is blue Okay, and then food is orange. Okay. Oh, I missed another groceries. And I believe pink is personal. Yes. And there was no gas this week, so. Okay. So, I'm gonna come down here and add that all up. Personal, food, groceries and gas which we already know gas is zero let me zoom you in just a little bit okay so we're gonna do personal first 
1125 plus 14, 14 equals 10513. Ah, always big bucks. Food 506 plus 613 plus 3436 plus 1147 equals 5702. Perfect. Now groceries 1489 plus 5663 equals 7152. Okay. So if I add all that up, that would be 105, 13 plus 5702 plus 71.52 equals a total of 233.67. Woo! Expensive. Oh, well. At least I have the money to cover it. Even though it went over the budget I set, at least I know I can cover that amount. So this is what I spent for the week of the 11th to the 19th. If you guys, ooh, sorry. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button. And if you'd like to, um, Sorry. And if you guys like to see more videos like this one, please subscribe. I would love it. I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.